Here's an update from the law offices of Hoyt and Brian. Every 60 seconds, there are millions of Facebook posts, tweets, and Google searches. In addition, more than 3 million emails are sent every second. Our lives are becoming more and more virtual. If you have an email address, a Facebook account, or bank online, then you have an online presence and valuable digital assets. These days, so many aspects of our lives are digital, and controlling these assets in the event of our incapacity or death raises all new issues never experienced before. If you become incapacitated, grow seriously ill, or pass away, Chapter 740 of the Florida Statutes outlines how your agents can access your digital records and grants custodians authorization to release such assets. Without proper planning, your family or friends may have trouble tracking down and accessing your online accounts that may have sentimental, practical, or monetary value, says attorney Michelle A. Adams of the law offices of Hoyt and Bryan. You should consider updating your estate planning documents and seek to broaden the powers to your fiduciaries that are provided by the Act or appoint a separate tech-friendly person to manage your digital assets in the event of your incapacity or death. You may also want to consider using the online tools offered by Google, Facebook, and other leading digital asset custodians to designate a representative for your digital assets on these sites. The Florida Fiduciary Access to Digital Assets Act can be complex, and some of these issues are so new there is no controlling case law. The law offices of Hoyt & Bryan is Central Florida's leading estate planning, administration, and elder law firm. Their mission is to provide the highest quality legal services, focusing on education, the client experience, and the development of lifelong relationships. For more information, visit HoytBryan.com.